Welcome to the week 15. I hope you guys had a great vacation last week. Got some rest, did a lot of turkey, did some shopping, and we're ready for the last three weeks of the week 15 prior to the Lord calling us to leave. So we are in week 15, so I'm going to give you a little idea of what this week is. Um, before you begin, So you're going to click on the file. Uh, this is the video that you're watching right here. And then this is the checklist that you need to, um, you have. You do not have to do anything with it. You don't have to actually check it off and submit it to me. It is for you. I create it for you so that you know what we are learning, what your objective is for the week and um, what needs to be done. So um, we are at, oops, I didn't change that to 15. Oh, sorry about that. So we're in week 15, and you have your three assignments. You'll have your two face-to-face uh, -face that are voluntary. They're tomorrow or they're Monday at 11 and Wednesday at 11. Our essential question is pretty much the same thing that we have been working on all year using word processing and does organization increase productivity? Our learning objectives are about doing edits in text. You're going to be able to translate text. And then you're going to be able to read a graph and apply it to your performance. So assignment one is you're going to download a file and then you're going to follow the video so that you can do several things to it. Um, the two biggest ones that we're working on this week are spell check and translation, but we're also doing headers and footers and page numbers. So if this one is basically using some more of the ribbons and learning the different edits that are possible. Then assignment two, you're going to be taking what you have learned. So you're going to go here to this page and you're going to copy and paste the information. It is for information only. You're going to put it on a file, you're going to narrow the margins, you're going to add page numbers, you're going to put a word count, and you're going to translate it to a language. Then you will submit the file. And then the last thing for this week will be typing. This week is typing. And so what I want you to do is you're taking a typing test and then there is an infographic that I have attached that shows what you should be typing in certain grade levels. And I want you to then copy and paste the sentence that's within the assignment so that I know that you understand the infographic and where you stand um, based on the averages of typing speeds for the different grade levels. All right, so as always in the um, weekly assignments, I have intro videos that will give you more explanation. I will go over this live on Monday at 11. So you can ask questions if you get that far. And if not, I hope to see you soon. I hope you had a wonderful week. I hope you have a wonderful week. And if you have any problems or questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to me. Have a great day, and I hope to see you soon.